hello to all my friends out there and so I have to go through my stockpile and see what food I have and what food I need and so this is a little box and I managed to pack quite a bit of food in here and I do that on purpose because if I would ever have to evacuate, I want to be out of here in minutes. So on the cans that are kind of heavy, I, I um, pack them in in a small box. And one of the things, like if, there was, if I was really pressed for time, one of the things I would want to head out of the house with is my box of meat. So, okay. Uh, I have I like eight cans of canned meat and so I have two cans of spaghetti sauce uh, one can of Vienna sausages two cans of hash browns so you know for the stockpile right now if I have two cans that's fine okay I only have one can of gravy and so um, I will make a list and I will put one can chicken gravy in case I want to make some gravy and I have uh, one can of cooking spray I had two but I started using the other one and then these are my coffee creamers I have three and I found these uh, where is this this one uh, you get a lot more creamer for a dollar if you go to the dry one so I learned that and then I have, you know, some chicken and some beef. And I have a lot more um, chicken bouillon than beef. So I need at least one. And then I have uh, two of these packages. And so um, a lot of times when these packages go on sale, you can get them really, really cheap. Okay, so I have one, one can Kipper Snacks. And I have two cans of these uh, salmon fillets. And I have some canned ham and some canned chicken. Okay, so that is four. And I have only one can of deviled ham. I like six of these, so I need to buy five. And then I have about four cans of salmon and five cans of tuna so i'm good on canned fish but all i need it for this is and so you can see my little box is pretty neatly packed and i do that on purpose so i can see what i have so all i really need for this box is uh, about five cans of deviled ham and one can of chicken gravy for the canned meat box and then on the bigger boxes I pack lightweight stuff in those like the cereal the flour so okay so here is the stockpile box for canned meat and what I just wanted to mention is this is a pretty small box but it's a sturdy box and so on the boxes that I would want to take with me if I had to evacuate I put those in the front so this one will be in the front because I know then I can buy um, a little mayonnaise and a little um, bread and boom I can survive so and you know in the afternoons every afternoon you know I like to have a sandwich and some soup or some kind of snack so okay God bless you all